welcome back. This is Beller Scuba with another StarCraft II commentary. Except not really a commentary. Now that I think about it, this is going to be another episode of the Let's Learn StarCraft II series. I'm um, just going up against a medium AI opponent here because the AI loves to rush. And for the strategy that I'm teaching you today, it is not a good idea to go up against a computer that likes to rush. I'm going to be doing the two racks fast expand here probably be following it up with the the five racks that is my favorite strategy for the two racks fastest man but you never know I might throw a, something else in there now nah, probably not once again we're, we're still doing the same basic things just uh, putting the SCVs on mineral patches that aren't being harvested yet once that guy comes back in the other one pops out he builds a supply depot um, this is the guy I usually queue as number one I uh, just want to go in and find out what race the opponent is and then we can come right back here Once again, you want to train SCVs at all times. Uh, they will be getting you all your minerals, which is very important, especially with this build. Don't get that second SCV yet, even though you have the minerals for it. Get this guy down here, build yourself your first base. That is very important. And then you should have just enough minerals to start the SCV once the last one canceled. So here we go, I am up against a Zerg player. Uh, normally that would mean I would want to block off, but because it's only a medium opponent, I don't feel like blocking off today. So I'm going to still go for the two racks fast expand, not too worried about it. Looks like I have just enough for another barracks right now. Uh, one thing you want to keep in mind is that you do need that second supply depot up early one more SCV coming out and then I should have enough for the orbital command there we go and look at that perfect 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 need to get us another supply depot out now once he's done he can go back here once again no gas no gas yet uh, you don't want to get the gas for this build uh, let's get another marine yeah, this takes a while. Uh, it's a really slow uh, build to start off. You know, you're not doing as much as you would think you would do. That supply depot once is is a little bit late. Not that big of a deal though. Actually, no, 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 no. You need to go down here, and these marines need to come down here. So a new rally point. Once he gets here, you should have just about enough. There we go. For a new command center, there you go. Two racks, fast expand. You are going to need to build another supply depot about now, as well as your first gas. That is important. Just continuing to put out a couple marines at a time. Uh, let's get this guy down here. I need a bunker. Bunkers are crucial to this build. If you do not have a bunker, you're not doing it right. These guys, once again, a little bit out in front. Um, that way they can guard the, the guy building the bunker. And then there we go. Looks like we're all set. This guy can actually go back to building, or uh, sorry, harvesting minerals right now because by the time um, we're going to run out of supply, uh, this command center should almost be up and then it shouldn't be a problem after that. This guy can go back to the mineral line as well. Almost to the point where I want to get those uh, add-ons onto the tech, or the the reactor and the tech lab. No, 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 no. Sorry. Oral command immediately. Alright, and then send them both for four, and then there we are back in the end. Now getting the add ons on these guys. And now I have really high minerals, but don't worry too much about it because you will be spending that pretty early on. That was not a smart move, my, my friend. 
That is why it's only a medium opponent. I mean, this is where it really starts to pick up. See, now I'm at five racks here. Continuing to produce SCVs. Gonna start getting uh, Marines and Marauders out exceedingly fast. And I do mean exceedingly. It's a big word for what I mean to say. So here we go. As you can see, that bunker is what saved me there. Looks like the second tech lab is almost up. There it is. Uh, let's get another reactor. And we can start... No, nope, there we go. Just in time for a stim pack there. Almost up to 25, so I can get that uh, third tech lab. I still have quite a few minerals, as you can see. That is not too big of a problem, because as you can see right there, it just... It just drops. Uh, I still don't have enough gas, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get um, second refinery and uh, an engineering bay. And look at that. I'm out. I'm out of everything. No, 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 no. There we go. You know what? Uh, since this is a medium opponent, I feel pretty safe here. Going for the push. Uh, you do want to do it relatively aggressively, uh, relatively early. Um, you want to be able uh, to get uh, the benefits of that, that fast expansion as soon as possible. And you want to take control. You want to make sure first that this opponent doesn't have an expansion of their own. Uh, as you can see, he does not because he's a computer, and computers don't realize the importance of expansions early on. I don't have stim pack yet. I'm not too concerned about it. See, he's on one base hydras. That is not a smart strategy. Don't do that if you're a reserve player. Uh, you just—it's not. You can't afford it really. I mean, look, look, he's got nothing left. And, I mean, look at all the tech structures that he's got out. He's got an inf infestation pit, evolution chamber, spawning pool, baneling nest. That is not what you want to do. Uh, and as you can see, I'm, I'm way too high on minerals uh, now. And gas, pretty much. Uh, because, really, uh, five racks is not enough for two bases. It really isn't. Um, you would think I was joking, but it, it really isn't. Never even needed to use a single stem pack. This guy, if he was a real opponent, he would have left a while ago. This is... yeah, don't play like this. And I know there are people out there that do. Just let me get as much tech structures as I can, and hopefully the guy doesn't attack me until they're all up. That's not how the game works, my friend. Especially in the lower levels. Finally he wants to surrender. I will accept. And that is the game. Let's look at what he had left. Absolutely nothing. Sent in my reinforcements. It's clearly game over here. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Learn StarCraft 2. This is another basic opener for Terran players. This is two racks, fast expand into five racks. You don't have to do it into five racks. Of course, you can uh, start uh, working on your gas instead and get uh, any sort of tech that you want. Um, as you can see, this is about the point that you would want to transfer. Uh, we are oversaturated here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.